out and, and update them. So um, I'm going to welcome you in. I'm also going to let you know, for those of you that might be here for the first time or maybe just the second time, of what this, the purpose of the call is, how we typically run it, and uh, what you can expect each week. Um, you know, we put this call on specifically sponsored by corporate uh, with different topics each week, different guests each week. We want to be fresh and to, to constantly rotate topics and keep you guys sharp. And as I say every week, just about, this is not meant to replace in any other team calls you do. So keep jumping on all those team meetings, team calls, and opportunity calls, and all the other stuff that you guys do. Uh, this is not meant to replace that. This is just meant to supplement that. And uh, what we wanted was basically an avenue for us from corporate to connect with you guys as independent business owners uh, with just the latest information. And, and training and whatever it is that helps you grow your business and helps you stay in touch. So if we've got announcements about new products, new policies, reminders, um, we like to put them out to this channel. You know, there's a lot of information flying around social media. You guys are fantastic about staying in touch with each other. Uh, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, I mean, they're all blowing up. Some of our hashtags uh, have some of the best traction you know, in the industry. So you guys are doing a great job staying in touch and communicating with the business. And um, I couldn't be more proud of that. But you and I both know that where there's a lot of talking, there's a lot of chance for misinformation or misunderstanding. And so every once in a while, something will get out there and something will say it just a little bit incorrectly. And then it'll grow. And then it'll grow like a fishing story pretty soon. You know, that little four-inch fish you caught turns into a great white shark. And uh, so we want to keep those rumors from growing out of hand and have a place that we can kind of address any questions that are out there. So that part of the call is to just give you information straight from corporate so that you've got it. Uh, you've got the facts firsthand. It's also a chance to introduce uh, new folks to the flavor of the company, uh, a little bit about our corporate personality and sort of what's important to us. Um, you will hear myself and Jason Elrod. For those of you that don't know, Jason is the president of Wake Up Now, and uh, he and I work very closely together. We're, we're good friends. We go back a number of years, even before Wake Up Now, a couple other ventures. But uh, I have the privilege of, of knowing Jason for a while, but he's a, a good, quality human being, first of all, uh, and sharp as a tack when it comes to business. But you know, you're going to hear him use the phrase Wake Up Now family a lot. And so I want to start tonight's call by just welcoming you, first of all. If this is your first time on the call, you have no idea what Wake Up Now is. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to welcome you in, and although this is not specifically an opportunity call or a business overview, uh, I sometimes take a couple minutes at the beginning of each call just to kind of welcome you and let you know what's going on. But, you know, that using that phrase, wake up now, family, is not an accident. We all kind of sat around and talked about what makes our conferences great, what makes our regional meetings so great. And, uh, you know, one of the answers that comes back is not just the comp plan and the details of the product, and those are all great, by the way, but... In the end, what it comes down to is a sense of, you know, there's a sense of connectedness, there's a sense of mutual support, teams that, you know, they're out there cranking and working hard to uh, to build leaders and, and grow their teams, but in the end, people help each other, people from different teams and totally different downlines that reach out and help each other because we really are sort of working uh, on the same cause, and that is to grow the company, grow the business, and ultimately sell products that help people because we pride ourselves on the fact that we're not selling overpriced products that are stacked up in somebody's garage that people don't really want. These are products that people need to use and, and changing and swirling all the time uh, for the better. For those of you again that are brand new, uh, we have a suite of digital products uh, like personal financial management software, tax deduction software, because everybody here is a business owner. Uh, so a lot of online tools that we uh, offer as part of our packages, but then also physical products from skincare, personal care to our energy drinks, which are obviously right now leading the pack as our most popular products. And the sky's the limit, by the way, on, on the physical products. Um, there's a revamp coming to a number of these products. So just I'm telling you right now, if you do not have plans yet to be at the corporate conference, you will want to be. I'll mention that again before we hang it up. But uh, new products will be unveiled at the corporate conference, so you want to be in touch with what's going on. But there'll be some variations on our current products, um, some new enhanced versions, and uh, I know that Thunder is going to be getting at least uh, you know another variation or so on, uh, on flavor and ingredient mix. Uh, you've got you know a number of things in terms of the warm beverage categories, coffee, hot chocolate, there's some cool stuff coming. And uh, why is that? Again, for those of you that are maybe new to Wake Up Now, you're wondering, well, what is it exactly that you sell? 
um, are you an energy drink company or are you a coffee company or are you a you know travel company because of vacation club and all those things? And the answer is yes to all of the above. So Wake Up Now is more than just one product. Wake Up Now is a platform to sell products and, and pay a handsome commission to those who help us market those products by word of mouth. So I encourage you, if you're new to the to Wake Up Now or you're just on here to, to kind of check things out, uh, talk to the person who invites you to the call and make sure you get more details on what that means. But Wake Up Now is aggressive in the commission it pays uh, because we believe in the value of the products and because we're not at the mercy of trends. We are not, uh, you know, at risk if some fad goes away. Um, I think those of you that uh, have been on the call before, Tom, we just had a meeting out here in Southern California uh, with some local leaders, and uh, Darren Fryer brought some folks over from Hawaii. But it was a, a big meeting where I said specifically, and Jason mentioned it again, we're not at the mercy of trends. If, if the government were someday to wake up and decide, no more energy drinks, too much caffeine, kids are killing themselves with caffeine, energy drinks are hereby outlawed. You know, wake up now doesn't go away. We would, of course, modify the thunder line if we had to to, to make it uh, compliant with any new laws or whatever. But even if that would happen, right, worst case scenario, we'll be fine because we're not just an energy drink company. So we'll sell whatever people need or want in their lives. And, and through the hub, the deal stream, right, we'll be able to move products from any category, just like Amazon does, and pay a commission for folks who help do that. So we are so excited about the fact that the business model is unique, uh, the product offering is unique and valuable, and uh, these calls are just one of the ways to stay in touch with, uh, with what's happening. Um, I really only have one housekeeping item that I want to share with you guys, and it's really just kind of a request on, on my part to, to protect your businesses um, and really to protect yourself from going crazy. And what am I talking about? I'm going to use an analogy I used in Southern California because we were near the beach for that meeting, and so I used this analogy with those guys. But imagine being at the beach, whether it's a lake or, or ocean, but there's sand, and you know how kids play with in the sandbox, right? They got their big buckets, and they're throwing handfuls of sand into the bucket, right? Well, you guys are trying to build your businesses. You're trying to throw as much sand into your bucket as you can, right? Meaning new customers, you know, new IBOs that are part of your sales team, sales volume, right? That's all sand that you're throwing in the top of your bucket. And you so you're using big cells, or you're just using two handfuls at a time, whatever it is. But you're working hard to throw all the sand in the bucket. But the problem is, some people wonder why they're not making more progress when they're working so hard. They're throwing tons of sand at the top of their bucket, and they don't understand why it's not getting more full. And the problem is... This line is now on hold. This line is now off hold. All right, well, good evening, Wake Up Now family. It is, but you've got the same issues. Those are people employed in ways they've never been. They're out there whether it's mobile and, and everything's electronic, everything's online. And so the crooks know this, the bad guys, the predators, they all know the people that moved online, so they have moved online. Uh, the, the children are under attack, the victimized, you know, not necessarily physically in school, parking lots or whatever, it's online. you got to be a little bit worried if you're a parent about what your children are seeing, doing, and experiencing, but you've got the same issues um, with individuals, for business professionals. Um, individuals. So we do face those unprecedented threats. Social media is a, is a hotbed for this kind of uh, privacy and safety uh, crime stuff. Cyberbullying happens. The bell tracking, geotracking. You, you've got the, safety, the digital device trend that's exposing people in ways they've never been at uh, risk before. So Cyberhood Watch is sort of the, the tool that, that brings the education and the alerts and the tips that you need to stay on top of all that stuff. You think how fast that stuff evolves. Think about fast wake up now is evolving through social media and the online world. Well, the criminal is fast, so as we use the internet more, as we use devices more, as we use the you turn the bells off. We have to be educated. You've got to stay current with those latest trends. So the Cyberhood Watch program is like the internet the neighborhood watch program. It provides you the alerts, instant alerts and tips and education that you need to stay safe. If you have a family, family just as much as does you individually. Really, at this point, it's your responsibility to stay up on the latest threats and risks. And the only way to do that is to have a source that you can turn to for those tips and alerts and information. How would you know 
that there was a big wave of threat going on. Uh, you wouldn't unless somebody were to tell you, based upon our broadcast, that the security company was really feeding you instantaneously when you threat hit. And, and I bring up Facebook because there are lots of examples of how the predators are using Facebook, and they're using Instagram, and they're using Twitter and other things to get at you and get at your information. It's not the appropriate to try to get at you physically. But, uh, right. You need the tips and alerts firsthand, and that's what that service does. It's got a great resource center full of education for you, and it's all accessible right in the hub. When you log in, it's right there in the hub. Those alerts, there's a great Facebook page for One Protect. If you haven't liked the Facebook page for One Protect, do so, because all those tips and alerts and education are posted uh, several times a week. There's great content on that uh, One Protect page on Facebook, so go, go look for that and like that, and then you'll be sent through Facebook as well. Uh, there's software you can download for Windows and Apple computers, uh, and then you can read a whole library of information. It's all available right through the Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what, what excites me most about that, as somebody who is online a whole lot. You know, I like reading blogs. I like reading articles. I'll, I'll go to ESPN.com for sports updates. And I'm online a lot. thought of having to go research where the threats are coming from, how to protect myself, and to have to take the time to find all those resources is pretty much what keeps people from doing it on their own. So, guys, for everybody listening, the fact that all of that stuff has been gone through, sorted through, and it's being watched and monitored by Jamie's entire organization, the experts in the field and the professionals who do this full time, and then being delivered to us in a way that's easy to read, easy to find, um, whether you use the internet for your personal you know, business, for fun, for your personal life, or, again, if you're a parent, uh, there's a, this is in all bold and caps because it's that important. Um, that education piece uh, is huge. So that's number one. Cyber watch, being aware, what are the latest threats? Um, it's as simple as he said, Facebook. I, you know, I've met multiple parents who don't understand the security settings and realizing that the stuff their kid puts out there is visible to everyone and anyone and that they've got 5,000 friends, you know, 99.99% of whom they've never met and don't know. So little things like that all the way through the major things. So there's Cyber watch. Um, and then comes the six year PC makeover, which is, you know, no stranger to everybody. Um, the more time you spend online, the more time you have for the bad guys to get access to your computer or the... Moderator has disconnected. The call will now end. Oh, I'm sorry.